Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Distant Worlds Universe. So we have actually made a decent little growth spurt here, taking, you know, the uh, Remus territories, and almost in one fell swoop, taking the Chalnoth. They have one last little piece of territory that we are going to get here in the relatively near future. They are busy um, fighting off a rebellion, it looks like. Um, and so I just need to get my fleet... The eighth fleet, which is in orbit and has three infantry, we need to come to one of these planets. Um, these guys are rebelling here, so we don't want to do that. So yeah, the eighth fleet. Those guys are probably going to rebel soon. Hmm, that's a bummer. I need just a handful of troops, but we're not going to get them anytime soon. Move to. Come on. Come on, there we go. Remus. Do I have any ships on or anything on Remus right now? It shouldn't take too long to build something on Remus. All right, so that should get us... Um, yes, we do want to colonize this. That should get us what we need. And we just apparently got advanced jump stalling, which is really good timing here. Um, we, we would like to get the G1-4000, but right now we'll stick with the G1-1000 because there's other things we do need to get here um, sooner than later. I realize I say um a lot. I'm going to try to stop doing that, but it's difficult when you're doing multiple things at the same time and your brain is trying to be stupid, which is what our brain does a lot. Let's get rapid assembly. Um, after long range scanners, is this where I get, uh, yes, we're going to get the Imperial Senate or uh, the, yeah, Romulan Imperial Senate. We're going to get that included in our future uh stuff as well all right cool so eighth fleet i want you to go to remus um fifth fleet i want you you guys need to go refuel this is the enemy 50th fleet i believe and we'll get all these ships once we take their their last planet that's why we're we're being a little bit aggressive here the enemy third fleet uh, 13th fleet has decided it's in their best interest to engage us here. We need some fleet. Oh, here's a carrier. Let's get that bad boy taken care of. We need, we're going to need somebody to retake the post up here. Even though the 5th fleet is up there refueling. The 4th fleet, let's have you guys refuel as well. All right, so we're at speed four. Game hasn't crashed. That's good. Um, long range scanners have been produced. That is also good. So what we're going to do now is we're going to open up our designs and our main designs that we're going to edit are our spaceports. So we are going to manually upgrade this design. It has quantum torpedoes. We want to give this type two disruptors. They had 16 type one disruptors. And we're going to get rid of all the concussion missiles because they just suck. Um, do you have a fighter bay? You have two standard fighter bays. Okay. We do want to give you a couple point defense cannons. Um, we want to give you 16 type 2 disruptors. You have spatial torpedo. You have quantum torpedoes. Good. Um, you got plenty of energy collectors. Good. You have the right types of shields. Good. What reactor are you using? Quantum reactor. Good. Um, and then what we just want to do is throw down a hyperdeny. And we want to throw down a uh, long-range scanner and a basic proximity array. I'm actually going to click on this. It's going to bring something up. Come on. Come on. I want. I actually do want to bring up... I don't want two basic proximity arrays. I actually want you to bring up the... Uh, whatever. I want to bring up the information about it, but that's okay. still have the death ray, which is good, but we're not going to build it because I feel like that's totally cheap. All right, cool. And then we're going to do the same thing for our medium spaceport. You want one of these bad boys. You want um, both long range and basic proximity array. We want to give you a hab module and a life support module. We want to change these 26 type 1 disruptors into 26 type 2 disruptors 
I feel like you don't have much more firepower than the other one. It's probably because you only have 15 quantum torpedoes. Do you have a... Okay, good. You don't have any of those, those whatchamacallit machines, the, the missiles. We do need to give you, um... Maybe 10 point defense cannons, and I'm going to give you another 5 quantum torpedoes. Beautiful. You got plenty of energy. That's that's important. All right, um, and then we're gonna manually upgrade our large spaceport. Do a very similar thing here. Um, we are going to give you it. Ten more quantum torpedoes. You have plenty of energy. Uh, we need to give you have thirty type one disruptors, and I'm gonna actually change that to. 40 type 1 disruptors. We're going to give you a hyper deny, of course. We're going to give you prox sensor array and long range sensor array. And then we're going to give you the hab modules that you need. Where is this? Life support and hab. Beautiful. So you have some decent firepower. It's still not a ton, but 1850 is some pretty decent firepower. You have plenty of energy still. Cool. And that's all we're going to do for now, I think. These guys all should be in good order. Oh, and then we're of course going to... Gonna go by spaceports. We want to retrofit our large spaceports. And then we're going to retrofit our medium spaceports. And then we're going to retrofit our just one small spaceport. Um... That should be fine. Seven Fleet, are you guys still engaged, this, these guys here? So this is good, because he'll have his Hyper Deny here in, in the relatively near future. Yeah, all the spaceports are getting uh, retrofitted, which is really good. You haven't finished retrofitting yet, which is unfortunate. So Eighth Fleet, I want you to refuel at Remus. And then once you guys refuel, I'm going to have you guys... Oh, they've imposed trade sanctions. That's too bad. I'm going to have you guys load troops at Remus. Did you guys build any troops? You got you got a few. So we have three infantry and three armor. Um, if we go to their capital here, can I get any troops from these guys? Oh, yeah. I can definitely load troops here. Load troops at Chalna. And this should end the war. Yeah, this should end the war for us. And we still have a uh, rebellions going on. No, not really. There was something in the Baxel system. Apologize to the Cardassians ahead of time. All right. The enemy 55th fleet is here in the Haracha system. What are you doing here? They're attacking my medium spaceport, is what they're doing. I have a fleet down here somewhere. I do, the fourth fleet. We're going to go down here and engage. Not happy about this, because I might lose this spaceport. Losing the spaceport would suck. Yep, there goes the spaceport. Well, new medium spaceport is going to get constructed there. Who invaded Remus? Oh, these guys are invading. Oh, and they probably destroyed my spaceport. God darn it. They've shown up with a surprising number of ships that I want to end. So yeah, 8th Fleet, if you guys just go fight here, that should end the war for us. Um... Yeah, they, they showed up with a surprising number of ships. And they're causing me no... Yeah, and there goes that spaceport. Seventh Fleet took a decent little beating here. Who the hell's invading my planet? Yeah, so that should... Once the Eighth Fleet arrives, this war should end anyway, because this will be their last planet. 
Yep, and we got plenty of troops here, so this should end in our favor. And that should end this war. I'm going to zoom out because I want to see these fleets come, become mine. Come on. There we go. So they caused me a little bit of headache here, but we've managed to end the war in our favor. Fourth Fleet, you really need to refuel. So let's look at these ships here. You got seven ships. We have a capital ship, 315 firepower. They're using assault pods. Um, transport, okay, I see. That's what the transporter thing was all about. They got photon torpedoes, Nova Core reactors. <laughs> Excuse me. Got a weird breathe, breathe there. I do need to give better prox arrays to all my ships. All right, so you guys are all just going to immediately get... Um, so I want to retire all ships at near a shipyard. That's good. And then we have lots of ships out here. That's my colony ship. Are any of you guys good? We got some, so another capital ship. What else do we get here? Any of these carriers? Troop transports. Iraq 4 is a destroyer with almost no firepower. Whatever, so we're gonna take all of you. You're a frigate, okay. We're going to retire all ships at nearest shipyards. In fact, um, there's a better way to do this, which is to go to ships and bases. Military ships here. None. They got a decent number of capital ships. But unfortunately for them, none of them are good. Point defense cannons, phasers. So yeah, we're going to retire all the ships we just got from them. Retire. Yes. So this should be all ships that we just got from them. Cool. We can now start seeing things around our systems, which is good. Um, who are you? You are the... Uh, oh, are the Ferengi at war with the Borg? They are. Okay. Good for us. I like how we sliced right through the Borg territory right here. That, that makes me pretty happy. Now, we're though, we're going to be in the point where we need to rebuild many of our ships. The spaceport here got destroyed. I'm actually going to build here a large spaceport at Remus. Build at planet Remus. Large spaceport. We do still want to try to get a spaceport here, but we've got to wait till we can crush these rebels. Or those pirates, I should say. I apparently have military forces in the Malice system right now. I have a construction ship, and of course construction ships have weapons. Astarte has been colonized. Move to the Arson system. Can't tell what sis who owns that system at the moment. Look at this battle going on in front of me while I colonize the planet. Let's just uh, throw down some... Oh sweet, we re received a research bonus. Let's see how strong these guys are while we're here. Their cruiser has 355 firepower. Their capital ship has 784 firepower. That is um, a little scary. Let's look at our ships. Our biggest ships, which are our cruisers, have 750s firepower. So actually we're doing okay, firepower wise. Fifth Fleet, did you ever get your act together? Yep, we're getting some, some decent technology bonuses by disassembling all these things. What was that? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, we, he someone got a poor recruiter trait. That's too bad. We don't have any um, intelligence agents. That is correct. Because we suck. Um, we do need to uh, update all our designs. So I can actually do auto upgrade on these designs. Did any of you actually update? You got the spatial torpedoes. And you didn't get the proc scanners. 
basic proximity array. Um, and uh, no spatial torpedoes. Quantum torpedoes. Where are you, quantum torpedoes? God, I hate that that did that. And also, um, I did see the Shadow Cloak ECM. We should be using that. All right. Save. Manually upgrade design. Make sure. No, cancel. Edit. So you have the bad reactors. Oh, I, I do want to change the. So I'm actually going to go back and update that design in a second uh, that I just did. The one thing I need to change there is to give it more. Um, Fuel, spatial torpedoes, quantum torpedoes. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll put you at ten. Um, you have standard armor. I'm just checking to see that everything here makes sense. Uh, what I want to do though is you have plenty of energy. This should be fine. Um, what I want to do here is add the hab module. Or the this module and the Shadow Cloak ECM. Cool. You got 500 firepower. Cruiser. So I want to edit this. What did I want to edit into this design? Oh, I wanted to give them both more fuel. I need to do it like this. All right. Standard fuel cell. We're going to upgrade you. So now you have 13.3 range. And we're going to edit you at a standard fuel cell. So you also have more range. 13.09. That's good. Then we're going to manually uh, cancel, edit. That's fine. Um, once again, you guys probably have the wrong torpedoes. Yep. I want to give you guys the quantum torpedo. I'm going to give you 20. Um, we need to give you a bigger reactor and more fuel. Yeah. Actually, you're pretty good on fuel. Basic prox array. Um, reactor, Shadow Cloak ECM. I'm going to give you uh, two assault pods as well. And then I just need to give you a new quantum reactor. All right. So actually, you need another quantum reactor. Okay, now you have plenty of energy to be able to actually do everything you need to do at the same time. Shadow Cloak, blah, 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 quantum torpedoes. You type two disruptors, correct? We have no disruptors. Pulse disruptors. When did we get pulse disruptors? Did we steal some pulse disruption technology? Oh, apparently we got enhanced wave weapons. Oh no, we got them here. Somehow we got up to pulse disruptors, which give um, our 26 damage. And are pretty darn good. Yeah, that's a nice little firepower boost that we got there. Heavy disruptors are really good. They're not as good as extreme energy beams, which is why going down the phaser line at some point is probably going to be a good idea for us. Um, we can go down that line, so we'll consider that at some point. Um, quantum torpedoes. Yeah, so you're doing good. You have almost a thousand firepower now. And then finally our carrier. Uh, so nothing changed on this design. You can still go 11.43 sectors. I want to change you just a second. So I give you, I want to give you the shadow cloak. I'm actually going to give you a pair of assault pods as well. Uh, I want to give you basic prox array. I want to give you a fuel cell so you can go a little bit further. And, oh, did it, do you have point defense cannons? No, you don't. Everybody should have point defense, at least five point defense cannons. So I'm going to have to edit those back in. Um, but I'm not going to bore you guys with that. Uh, I probably bored you guys too much already. I'm going to do a little bit of off-camera work just upgrading my designs. But this is where we're going to end the episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. I know it was a, you know, a little slow compared to some of my other episodes. But I got a good, some good stuff done. On the next episode, we're going to rebuild most of our fleets. Uh, you know, Get these all back up to the right numbers. Uh, and then... Maybe get some more fleets. I don't know. but we'll, And figure out somebody else to go to war with. We kind of ran out of easy targets. Maybe these guys over here. The Eurydians. Um, might be a good easy target to go for next. With that all being said though. I thank you very much for watching. And I will see you all. Next time.